You got my bait, brother. You got my bait, brother. I just want it back. Son of a bitch. Whoop whoop, Juggalo Fishing fam. Welcome back to another episode of the Juggalo Fishing Posse. I am your host, Slash Gills. We have got an extra special episode for you today. An extra bomb ass, awesome, incredible, spectacular combustulation of footage that is going to blow your wig straight off your head. Today, we are going out to try and catch some fish. That's right guys, it's nothing out of the ordinary. Um, yeah, we're just down here at the creek spot again and uh, we're going to walk down into the creek a little bit and explore a bit. I've also got a new Akuma uh, spinning combo that I picked up. So uh, we're gonna be testing it out with uh, some different stuff. We're just gonna go and see if we can pull anything out. We, uh, I was gonna go yesterday, but we had a, uh, a front move in, a little pressure system, and we got a thunderstorm, and we actually got some hail. So I figured with that coming in, like around here, fish tend to usually shut down right before it, or at least in my experience they do. It's like they sense it approaching and then they they just turn off. But uh, we're going to get out here and give it a shot today. It's warmed up. I'm expecting the water to be a little bit cooler than the actual atmosphere. So, uh, yeah, we're going to see if that's got them stirred up at all. Um, looks like we do got some muddy water. So, I don't know. We'll see if we can come up with something. So, let's get down to the water and I'll meet you there, fam. Ooh, ooh. All right, I'm switching it over to this thing with the green and silver and brown and tan and I don't know, maybe it looks a little bit more natural. something oh my goodness what the heck wow was not expecting that in here what the heck chill 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 with that chill with that got a freaking snot rocket let me get my pliers it's gonna take that Easy, dude. Wow. This is probably why I can't get anything else to bite. Because of this toothy critter right here. Look at that. Just crazy. Freaking snot rocket, pike pickerel, whatever you want to call it. Get back in there, man. Wow. That's probably why I can't get anything to bite. Because <laughs> he's roaming around. Good lord. Well, that's a first for the channel, anyway. That just happened. Now I got freaking snot on me. All right, well, uh, after that, I think we're gonna make a little bit of a move. Go downstream a little bit. That was definitely a first for me. Not a giant by any means, but... 
as well. I don't even know how that guy got in here, where he came from. Threw it into a freaking limb. Alright, let's try that again. There we go. I don't know, I was kind of expecting to get something on that first cast. Not sure why. I guess because these things are a confidence lure, and for some reason, today they are not working for me. also tangling up on themselves. Come on, man. That does not make for good content. Gotta have my content. Alright, guys. I have set up a float rig. We're gonna use some of these gulp minnows. However, these are in the chartreuse. Wow, I just dropped it. These are in the chartreuse color. Sometimes I wonder when I come out here doing these videos, if there's any country ass locals sitting up in the trees just watching and listening to me talk to myself. I mean, I kind of get used to the idea of talking to myself, but you can never quite get used to the idea that someone is witnessing you talk to yourself. That's a whole nother ball game. Well, I had one little nibble while I was jawing the freaking teeth up. Come on. Is there anything else around here? Gotta be some big fish. Yeah, play with it. Go ahead. Dang. Alright. Got a new gulp minnow on. Plenty of fish over here disturbing the water. There we go. Finally something. What do we have? Bluegill. Red breast. Chunky little red breast, too. Pretty guy. been the ticket we needed to get these fish turned on. I don't know. See? Already got another one. Oh, he come off. Dang. Uh, he been up my freaking minnow too. Let me get something back there. There we go. Finally, what do we got? Please stay on. Ski him in here. What do we got? Look at that. Oh, easy. You gonna shit all over me, dude? Just like that. Heck yeah. That's a little rock bass. Looks like a little rock bass. Or it could be a war mouth, but that's hard to tell. Definitely not a green sunfish. Looks like a rock bass to me. I don't know. <laughs> totally get, didn't get that on film, but got a little uh, pumpkin seed guy here. Or red breast, whatever you want to call him. He, uh, I was sitting here trying to fix my camera, had it sitting in the water, like barely in the water. And he come up and grabbed it. That was weird. There we 
we go. Come here, whatever you are. Ba boom. Heck yeah. Big pretty red wrist. Nice. Alright. Rule number one of having a fishing YouTube channel. Make sure you're recording when you catch a fish. Otherwise, you're just talking to yourself. There we go. Feisty red breast, man. And this one, this one's actually a bluegill. Can I have my hook back? Thank you. Yep, bluegill. Awesome stuff. Boy, this minnow has seen better days. I'm gonna try it one more with one more fish, then I'm gonna have to replace it. All right, good spot. Right there's good enough. Right in front of that tree. There we go. Come here. All right, another bluegill. Thank you, buddy. Well, that's about had it for my uh, gulp minnow. He's about shredded into a thousand pieces, so. Got a little nugget. I think I might actually save this little guy. Yeah. I'm gonna save that little dude. I think I'm gonna let him sit on the bottom. All right, y'all. Got a simple rig, couple of split shots, and a hunk of bluegill. Let's put her out there on the bottom, see if there's anything. Toothy. We'll probably get a turtle, but I'm prepared for that. Alright, we'll let that sit. See what happens. Got a little blue gill. Little guy this time. Hmm. Shell cracker. Pretty red ear. Muddy red ear. There he goes. All right. Oh, shit. I'm going into the damn mud. get while we were waiting. Oh, blue you. Thanks for tearing up my gulf minnow there, buddy. Guys, we had something get the cut bait. He's got it. What do we got? Turtle. Sure enough, we knew he was going to get one too. Let's get him over here and get the pliers on him. Be still now. Alright, we'll get you unhooked in just a jiffy. Alright, Mr. Turtle, sorry about your. Uh, piercing there. I'm just gonna sit there, spooked. Get him back in. 
in there, buddy. There he goes. All right. Turtle. All right. New piece of bluegill. All right. Back over here to the bluegill, I guess. All right. Can we find a bluegill or two while we wait? Yes, we can. Ba Boom! That gum tree. All right. Thank you, little bluegill. Thank you for playing. Feels like a better one, maybe. He's not fighting much. Now, what do we got here? This. What the heck is going on with this guy? Is that another little rock bass? I don't know. Rock bass, poor mouth. Definitely got something messing with us over here. We got something. Probably another turtle. About how heavy it feels. Feels like a bigger one. I think this guy's a lot bigger. Yeah, he's digging into the mud. Get out of there. Oh, dude. Oh, this is a big snapper. Just let him run for a second. There. Get up. Get up. Good. Lord almighty, that is a big snapper. Jesus. Ooh. Well, y'all, one big giant freaking snapping turtle, and all I got to see was his face. He stuck his head up and opened his mouth, and off he came. Which is fine because I don't really know if I really want to wrangle with him right now, anyway. This thing. Oh shit, in the mud. Something's there. There we go. Yep, another snapper. Good lord, man. Look at that guy. Oh, he didn't like seeing me. Yeah, I see you and you got my you got my bait, brother. You got my bait, brother. I just want it back. I just want my bait back. Please. Pretty please. Bite the boot. Bite my boot. Go ahead. Got you. All right. If you could just hold still for just a moment. You smell like hell, dude. Not easy. Son of a bitch.
got it. All right. Not bad, homie. You can get on back. Go ahead. It's all you. Jeez. Louise. Oh. Folks, I'm telling you, I will never, ever, ever get used to the smell of a snapping turtle. If the bass aren't biting and the bluegill are being butt munches too, so I'd rather be catching turtle than nothing, I guess. God, that little freaking mud slide's gonna kill me. I got something up under the bridge. I knocked my other rig around. I'm gonna have to fix that. Thank you, sir. Ow. What hole? He stabbed me right back. In the shit up. I think we got another snapper. He's definitely got some weight. Oh my god, this thing is huge. And he is huge. Holy crap. Holy crap. Big giant freaking tur- Oh, okay. All right. He came off. Good. I didn't want to have to freaking wrangle that dude. Giant freaking turtle. Whew. Oh, well, guys, that was it for the day. It was a teetotal grind. But right off the bat, we got that uh, snot rocket, pike, pickerel, whatever you want to call it. Uh, got a handful of red breast, a couple of war mouth, rock bass looking things. Uh, plenty of bluegill, but no bass. No bass whatsoever. Kept getting little bitty nibbles here and there that could have been bass, but... I'm not 100% sure, but either way, that's what happened. So, uh, that concludes our episode, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for coming along with me. Thank you for watching. Thank you for hitting that like button and the subscribe button if you haven't already subscribed. And uh, I will catch you, fam, down at the water next time. So, until then, much wicked clown love to all you ninjas. Whoop whoop, tight lines, sharp hatchets. We'll catch you at the water next time, fam. Whoop whoop. Whoop whoop. <laughs>